All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. NBA 2K22, the boy, Mike Wong, has been tweeting, and I'm talking about tweeting a lot. Now, we're going to go over his video that he put on the, uh, what was it, the, the the game, the other, you know, whatever, whatever it is before you load into my career. We don't play my career, so a lot of people probably didn't see it, so we're going to drop that later on. But right now, we're just going to go over some tweets that he has been tweeting, and uh, I'm going to give my opinion on it, man. So if you don't do nothing else, make sure y'all give a like. Man, matter, matter of fact, Take two or take, take us take a few seconds right now. Like the video and tell me down in the comment section what do you want to see most in NBA 2K22. I'm gonna give y'all I'm gonna give y'all that time, man, because y'all need that time to let's 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 speak it into existence. Like we know we're not getting crossplay. I wish we would, but hey, it is what it is. Maybe there's a bombshell they're gonna drop later, man. But I wish we were. It seems like we're not. Hey, so we're not gonna get crossplay. Hey, it is what it is, man. But, hey, right, look, have you taken that time to go ahead and do it? Because if you hadn't, go ahead and like the video right now. And, uh, you know what I'm saying? If you like the video, then whatever you put in the comments might come true. Hey, that's what it is, man. So like the video, put down in the comment section what it is you want to see most in NBA 2K22. I'm going to tell y'all on the other side of this, and I'm going to be right back with y'all right after this. If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pipes, that shit made me a savage. Start hustling non-stop, don't plan on breaking that head. Alright, man, so check it out. Your boy Mike has been tweeting. And I said Mike has been mother tweeting. He been tweeting out here, man. And check it out, man. Look. It's so many, so many of these joints, man. We just gonna go go right. I'm gonna give you all my opinion on it and all that. And we just gonna go back. And the videos are back, man. The daily uploads are back. Probably gonna hit y'all with a two a day today. You see my boy Anonymous 2K TV is back. It's all back. It's all good, man. So, like I said, hey, I just didn't want to spam y'all with information that was just fake, man. But I'm gonna have to start doing that because, look, I, I found something out in the 2K community. Everybody want to tell you that you get, you get where you're going by being different. That's a lie. You don't get where you're going by being different. You get where you're going by being a different variation of the same thing. Case in point, Crown Royal. Crown Royal. You Crown Royal didn't get where they are by being a whole nother spirit. They didn't try to be vodka or none of that. So we're going to be, what, what, what it is? I don't even drink. So I, just, I, just, I just got the box and my first, hey, shout out to everybody that this was your first if this was your first wallet, put it down in the comment section with your daddy say, hell boy, put your coins in that down, that down boy. Put it down in the comment section. But I'm saying they didn't get where they're going by being a whole nother spirit. They said, we're going to make whiskey. We're going to make our own variation of it. That's how you get where you're going. That's why you got like, like you got rappers that try to be different. That You know what I'm saying? They, they really good rappers like Common and Hobson and all them guys. They dope, but they don't set as many records as the guys that are different variations of each other, like the Migos, Drake. Uzi all though. So like don't listen to that lie. Be a different variation of what everything else is. Coke, Pepsi, everybody got a sprite, all that. Anyway, man, we ain't here for that, man. But that's just a jewel for y'all this morning. Check it out. First thing Mike Wong says, lots of info to come. Where's the gameplay though? Hey, my boy said, where's the gameplay? Lots of info um will be hitting soon. And then he started answering questions, man. It's just like, will you only be able to purchase? Uh so he's talking about the um so he says some content will be season exclusive, but the uh, but the actual I gotta turn this to dark mode, bro. I can't deal with that light mode. Some content will be season exclusive, but the actual on-court gameplay, seeing shots, and all that will stay in the game once they're dropped. And now uh, this was somebody was asking. They were just saying, will will we only be able to purchase them uh, during the duration of the season? Because you know we got seasons coming to the game, and so they want to know will you only? Be? It's just gonna be like Call of Duty. Some of the stuff sticks. But some of the stuff is season exclusive because they want you to play during that season. It's, it's totally understandable. I get what they're trying to do. They're trying to extend the game. They want you to play it all year, give you a reason to play it all year round and not just get bored of it because, hey, this new city, hey, Curry Slide coming in season four. Like, I got to get out there and see what that's like. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I don't know. I don't see that being like, I don't see that being a real big deal. But, hey, it is what it is, man. Let me see. Uh, will you be able to uh, purchase them during uh, during the race of another season? Like he said, like that. All right, cool. Uh, Mike, if I get good at a jump shot and you take it out from the uh, from the new season, I won't be happy. Shots won't be taken out. Uh, they'll only be added. That's what he's saying right here. So that's cool. Um, let me see. How will shooting change exactly? Hard to explain in a tweet. Uh, main change. Main change is. Uh, Main change is a much larger weighing toward coverage, which which I, I like that. Aiming is gone. Explain uh explain more in the coming courtside report in a couple of weeks. Couple of weeks? Mike, what the f 
in a couple of weeks. Let me see. Uh, shooting, shooting is more predictable uh, this year. I'm really confident the community will like it. Like, I don't even know how shooting could be more predictable than this year because I, I shot, what, 66.6%, .6 something like that from the field, I mean, from three, and like 70-something from the field. So I don't, so I don't know how it could be more predictable, but hey, if it's going to be more predictable, um, you know, it, it, I guess it'll be I guess it'll be more predictable. Uh, one person asked, is Steady Shooter gone, Mike? And Mike says a resounding Yes, steady shooter is gone. Uh, can we dribble after a step back using the square, uh, the square again? And Mike says no. You can if you trigger the, if you trigger the shot with the shot with the pro stick. I'm not gonna lie. This is something that always separated dribblers from the people that could really play. My boy T Mizzle in 2K20 was a master at that because you couldn't do the step back just anytime you wanted to. But he was a master in 19 and 18. I mean seven. I mean 19 and 20 uh, going through the legs going this way and then he'll hit him with the step back and cross it over and stuff like that. Like, I think that's what separates the good players from the guys that's just out there hitting buttons and stuff like that. You just out there hitting buttons you shouldn't be, you shouldn't be rewarded with, with you know, just for doing some bull out there like that. It, you just shouldn't be rewarded for it. But hey, I digress. Um, Let me see what the next question was. The next question is, uh, let me see. Uh, What did he ask? And can you please let us know uh, can you please let us stay 99 after all, after all the hard work we put in instead of losing the 99 if your stats, uh, if you lose a game? Some of us don't have squads uh, and play with randoms. And then uh, Mike said, you won't lose your 99 this year. Now, like my boy Downwork said, that doesn't mean that they're going to have rolled the 99 this year or nothing like that. But what he is saying is, hey, you're going to... um. It ain't gonna be, you're not gonna be losing your 99 this year, man. It is what it is. Let me see, well, uh, someone asked, will animation slash SIGs be limited per position? For example, will we see uh, Power Force and Centers able to use the Curry Slide and other animations if if they're playing, uh, if their playmaking is high enough or is it certain animations locked to certain positions? And Mike says, we're gating more animations based on size and ability this year, which is the way that it always should have been. Um, I feel like, so many people are curry slide zen double speed boost made that they hey that them boys are in their pants right now because they know what time it is a lot of so like delayed says so many new guards came out of nowhere this year that was top comp guards that never been good at any other 2k but then like you got the guys like t miz and brute and all them guys that was always good they always play the game always adjust we're gonna find a way it don't matter what they do you're not gonna see me stop playing the game for a whole year just because i can't i can't play hey have y'all noticed that i'm just having i'm having so much fun with this button with the bleep button man this ain't dope man i ain't gonna lie to y'all i gotta go xlr so i gotta use it because i pay you know bridget keeps it, it was 250 dollars but bridget keeps saying it was 700 dollars so it is what it is but so many people was double speed boost curry slide man man and like so many other people just stopped playing the game it just was what it was man um and then so somebody else uh somebody else asked uh what's what's most important uh, in using the controller? Will it be muscle memory dribbling, uh, be the same, or will it, you have to learn how to dribble again? And Mike says, uh, dribbling is probably closer to 20 than 21, 20, uh, 21 control-wise. Uh, example, uh, do I got it long enough? Yeah, I got it. Holding the pro stick always shoots like 20, but there are some moves, combos, uh, you're going to want to learn. And like I said, man, I always have my suspicions. I really feel like 2K21 is 19 rehashed, and I felt like 2K22 is going to be 20 rehashed. Yeah, if, I don't know if y'all notice, it's like every other year it's the same game, it's rehashed, but it's from two years ago rather than one. Just like 18 was sort of like 16 rehashed, kind of, but it was just, they, it was just went terribly wrong or what have you. Um, so... Let me see what else do we, what else do we got right here. Uh, let me see. Will you still ha need a high three point shot um, in order to shoot or to shoot with? Uh, it was hard to shoot with the eighty. I don't know. I don't. I can't relate to that one. I uh, said so you don't have to have as high as last year the perimeter shooting uh, to be a perimeter shooting threat if you have good timing at least. But he said that last year, if you were in the seventies, you should be a solid threat. And we know damn well that people was in the seventies and you wasn't even a threat at all. Like we wasn't, people was in the seventies, bro. We wasn't a threat at all, period. Like, it, and that was in, that was on, no, that's on current gen. Granted, that's on current gen, but you wasn't a threat at all, period. You was out there. You got some of the best shooters. Like I said, you got T Mills. You got guys on the stage. You got me. 
bro, we you just couldn't hit consistently with a 70. You weren't a threat at all. People would literally just leave you open and dare you to shoot the ball. So I can't see how, you know, I, that, that remains to be seen, man. That, that is how it go. Somebody says, hey, Mike, is real player percentage in the game? Boy, y'all are so just gimmick made is not funny but he says yeah but he what he, he did say that it is in the game but what he didn't say is in what capacity is it in the game so we don't know if you'll be able to use it out there in the park like people was using and real three free throw percentage gimmicking that stuff right there and praying that you hit like stuff like that got no place in the game especially on the competitive side but you could do that and um what what was it in pro-am and stuff and people was cool with it I, I guess man you know it is what it is uh one person asked i would pay thousands of dollars to know i mean to know if you remove vibration from 2k22 uh can't have zen made bozos like 21 for 90 percent of the year mike says the vibration cue is gone and like i said he's probably asking because he's working on his script to try to get it working right because y'all like i said bro y'all boys is so fucking Curry slide, Zen made, double speed boost, screen and all that stuff. Like, bro, come on, ankle breaker. All y'all are so like, it, it just is what it is, man. I'm just telling the truth this year, man, it is what it is. And then uh, I think this is gonna be the last one. Will both next and current Zen receive the new animations and series or will it be some uh, exclusive to uh, to its generation? And, and he says the plan is to release the same SIG animation uh, on both gens. Um, what I feel like they probably did, man, is I think they probably just this the both games are probably the same based, but current gen is gonna be a much more stripped down version. Let me see how different is next gen from current gen. Current gen, um uh current gen and next gen are much more similar on court uh this year compared to last year. So I mean I think that's probably what they did. Does no shot meter still give you a boost? Yes, obviously we need that because you know I am. I'm no shot meter made. I ain't gonna lie about that. Curry slide is seasonal content. LMAO, the whole 2K guard community will be in shambles. Uh, maybe it's, I shouldn't release it at all. Hmm, Mike, if you really want the whole community to itself, then yeah, just don't release it at all. Like that's what I say anyway, bro. Like just, just don't release. Like like I said, you just everybody just asking these questions. They really want to know if it's gonna be in there for them. Cause I ain't gonna lie, even though I don't use it, my guard uses it and, and whatever he uses, I'm gonna support it, man. So it is what it is. I, I don't care if we, we, cause you have to adapt. Eventually, if somebody keeps using the same BS on you, then you gotta you gotta adapt. New jump shot land is Mike, yes. Yes, he says that, that's, that is a yes. And then, um, you know, and then this is like 31 minutes ago. To clarify, you won't lose overall on next gen as we have a different system in place in place there overall can still fluctuate in current gen so like you said there's a different system in place and that's what i was saying like that don't mean that road to 99 is still there that just means that you know that that's what and that's fresh off the presses right there i say that's fresh off the mother presses that's right he just said 31 minutes ago who is bringing you to stuff 31 minutes all the time like the video oh uh, let me see overall let me see overalls won't drop this year like he said uh let me see what else we got and new season of animation content drop uh are for my players only not nba not nba players the goal is to keep the game fresh all year and encourage players to use signature moves that they otherwise may not have uh don't worry they still will be there'll still be a ton of variety to choose from um at launch and it's gonna be a ton of variety to use from i don't doubt that but just people we just know that we just got such a cut and paste cookie cutter community that they just find what works in there everybody spam that and then mike says clarify you won't lose uh we already saw that you won't use it because of the different thing and uh yes there's a new shot meter yeah let me see will there be a new shot meter i don't even know who would think to ask that it's like he's picking and choosing what to ask let's refresh and see if he just said anything else because we up to the second with this thing man but anyway like i said i'm pretty sure my boy little thunder is already mad that the video is this long and he had to watch it so we're gonna get on up out of here man hope you guys enjoyed the video man if y'all don't do nothing else make sure y'all leave a like and let me know what y'all most want to see in, in nba 2k22 i just want to see minimal cheese and like if it, it's gonna be cheese in every 2k but something that we can actually stop and that people just can't rely on this year we would the, the double speed boost wouldn't even been a big deal or a big issue um it wouldn't even been a big deal or issue if if it wasn't for the zens 
and then people could just claim that they were good because you wouldn't have been able to shoot off of it because not everybody could quick stop. But you know, just something, if, if it's gonna be cheese, let it be skillful cheese or something like that, like the hop step. You gotta get to the rim in order to hop step. You know what I'm saying? You can't, you couldn't just, just get just hop step. But on this game, you just push through people. I know where you're going, I'm sitting there. I'm sitting on the spot and you still just push right through me bro like it is what it is anyway let me know what y'all think down in the comment section make sure y'all leave a like man i'm holler y'all next time until next time it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's channel Guys,